That feeling of just knowing a game is right for you when you first lay eyes on it is such a great feeling. The thing that happens is you, you start to feel the excitement just build up. I'm thinking about it all the time, even in my sleep. Incluso a veces por una misma comunidad, te llegas a enamorar bastantísimo. I play video games because I love stories. Experiencing worlds that you can't experience as yourself. I guess video games allow me to be what I can't. It's fiction, but it's not. And come home, log on to your PC, and disappear into a different world. I am a part of something bigger, a part of something beautiful. As an autistic person, video games give me a place where I could be in a world that made sense to me. I will tell you that all of my family play video games. Me and my brothers, we would share the computer one hour at a time. I'm really enjoying playing video games with my dad. My children. My little sister. That connection between video games allowing us to converse with each other added a lot to our relationship. Games like the World of Warcraft let me meet people that I probably never would have. I can honestly say I, I met some of my best friends through playing games. We have this connection that allows us to share our joys, to share our achievements, to share our growth together. Every time I'm able to achieve something, I'm able to make myself proud. Killing heroic Black Hand back in Warlords of Draenor was one of my favorite memories. I managed to find that one hidden pylon with my one mutilisk. We beat hardcore Inferno Diablo. I was able to hit gold in competitive in Overwatch. I had someone say, oh, I can't lose to a girl. Uh, and I beat that guy. So I was able to slay this warlock as a little gnome holy priest, freaking out and screaming the whole time. Adrenaline through my body was going crazy. Pela caminhada ter sido tão prazerosa e pela conquista ter vindo. A gente se sentiu muito, caramba, a gente conseguiu algo incrível aqui. I killed the Witch King! I killed the Witch King! Many years ago, I was doing a quest in Terracar Forest, and a lovely little mage came up and said, Would you like a hand? They helped me for the rest of the day. We've been married now for over a decade. Those video games filled a void. They filled the friendships that I didn't have. There isn't a huge LGBTQIA plus community in my city. So when I was able to play a video game, I was able to start talking with people who didn't really care that I was a gay male. But video games were my escape. When I was a teenager, my dad was diagnosed with ALS, and I looked to video games as a way to escape from that sort of reality. Everything happens for a reason, and I'm just glad video games were there for me. I'll never stop playing video games. There's no way. <laughs> I imagine myself one day being an 80-year-old grandpa gamer. Playing video games has shaped me. I don't think I would be who I am today. My passion, my interest, my excitement, they belong. Video games opened for me the world. And because of that, I'm forever thankful. And I can't wait to see what the next generation holds. <laughs>